Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to beef up and lose some weight and all that great stuff. We're going to see if this really works. Okay, so this is the Quintu Women's Dress Round. Oh, sorry, that's the wrong product. The Sabuk ABS Stimulator Rechargeable Abdominal Muscle Toner Trainer Portable Toning Belt Ultimate AB Stimulator for Men and Women, $39.99. Okay. So the question is, is this going to do everything it says? Now, what does it say it's going to do? Well, I'll tell you. They, they show before and after with one month of use of this. And they're saying it's going to take this and make it to where you can see my abs. Now, will it actually work in a month? I don't know. We're going to try it. But uh, it comes with these three, like, hockey puck things, if I can get them out of here. Um, and they're USB rechargeable, I think. Yeah, okay. So these the micro... USB. I definitely would not turn them on until they're hooked up because you could get zapped. Um, they got one little USB charging cable, which I'll probably keep in there. And um, anyways, I don't know how charged these are. I could get my um, my charger and bring it up here and see how many amps they draw just for you guys since you want to know, right? People want to know how much power these things draw. Um, let's see, wrong cable. Give me the right cable. Yes. Okay, and I love this little ch little charger because it tells you, you need, you know, plug in a whole bunch of devices, but it also tells you how much power you're drawing, so. Um, there we go. Okay, so this one's charging, and it is drawing 0.62 amps, which is actually quite a bit um, for this little thing. So the battery must be pretty hefty or something, I don't know. But yeah, 0.6 amps, that's 600 milliamps. And uh, it's it's charging, and I definitely don't want to sit it on metal or anything because it's got the metal on the bottom. But it comes with the body pad, which is to store this thing on, I assume, because it can be sticky. And you got to store it on something, and then you got uh, this one. These ones like for your arms, evidently. And I haven't read the directions yet. We'll let this charge a little bit while I'm reading the directions, I guess, and see if I can figure this out. But yeah, if I wear this for an hour a day for a month, I'm supposed to be like Batman I guess um, basic using method uh, does it say that on everything here no um, okay first side is safety second side is basic using method number and intensity of using take intensity 3 in state of fully charged as example it can support about 8 cycles each cycle 20 minutes okay so 8 times 2 so yeah that's over that's like uh Geez, it'd be like almost two hours. Um, yeah, so that'd be sixteen hundred and sixty minutes. Yeah, so that's definitely over two hours. Um, reduce the intensity can extend battery life. Okay, so how do we do it? Does it show? Okay, now it says you can put the whole thing around your upper arms or your leg or your abdomen. So the whole big deal it doesn't show the little ones does it no it just shows the big huge one um but it does show you can do your thighs and your arms and your abdomen um so adjustment of intensity stimulation intensity includes 48 levels press on dc button to turn the on then the blue light is on press the on dc button again the indicator light flashes press once to enhance by one level press what once the on off so we got, yeah, we got on, off, and then on, oh no, on DEC and on INC. So which one do we press? Uh, on I, IDC is what turns it on. Um, and apparently the on, I, uh, the on IDC, IDC, there is no IDC, there's a DEC, and an INC. So I don't know which one would be the IDC because neither one of them say that. There's a program one. Um, should we just turn on without anything attached and see what happens? I might get zapped. I don't want to get zapped. Okay, so we're supposed to hold on to... What did it say? Um, I got it plugged into. That could be bad. I might blow up my charger. I don't want to plug, I have a plug. Okay, it's charging less, so it's probably got a good charge. Okay, so we'll try, this is to turn it on, we press the, okay, 
So we just press it. Okay, so the button they're talking about is the INC that turns it on. Okay, then the blue light is on. Press the INC button again and the indicator light flashes. Okay, so now it's zapping. Um, yikes, I can hear it. It's like it's building up power. How do I turn it off? Oh, off. The off button isn't working. Oh, okay, you have to tap the off button is what decreases it. And when you turn it all the way down, it turns off. So I don't know what the program button does. That's a whole different thing. Program button to switch between different modes. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to try this on my arm first because I think that's probably safer than uh, not knowing what I'm doing and trying it on my abdomen. So... Let's see if we can cut the end of this open where they've got the slit thing. These bags usually never work right for me, so I'm just cutting it open. Um, good. These have little plastic things to go back on, so we don't need the body pad for these possibly because they just go back to normal. Okay. So I don't know exactly how these go on. I mean, I, I can only assume because of the pictures and stuff, and I think I think I got a good idea. So I'll go ahead and give it a try. Uh, I probably should have put this thing on it before I put it on my arm. We'll, we'll see how that works. Because I can't push where the buttons are or I'll get zapped. So, um, which way do we want to do it? I don't know. Ooh, I don't want to do it like that. Come on, now. I don't want to get rid of the sticky stuff. Okay. How about like this for now? We'll just try this and see how it works. I have no idea what it's going to do. Okay, so it's supposed to start with low intensity. If it starts with high intensity, I'm not going to be happy. So, come on, line up. Ooh, crud, almost the off button at least. I thought it was the on button. Okay, so tap once to turn on. Okay. Tap once to start. Oh, okay, that's definitely, <laughs> I don't even need to turn it up at this point. Okay, let's hit the program button. Oh, we gotta hit on each time. Okay, I'll hit on, I'm gonna be brave. Where's my on button? That's not that bad. Off just instantly goes off. Yeah, that really, that's pretty intense. In fact, it's making me, ooh, that kind of hurts. Um, it's making me want to contract, con contract my arm, but I got to avoid that because it, <laughs> when I did, it, um, it actually um, hurt. So I want to keep it straight. I'll try a different program. I don't like that program. That one's okay. That one's not bad. It's just like da 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 da. The other one really vibrates. Ooh, that one's actually doing all kinds of things. I'm not such a fan of that because it does the little thing that all of a sudden it hits you. And that was like a song. It's like da da da. Da, 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 da. Well, yeah, all kinds of different programs, so. I'll go back to the basic one. Let's try, ooh, jeez, I don't like bending my arm while I'm doing that. It hurts my muscles. And it could be because I'm wearing it wrong. I don't know. Because I got it right on my muscles, so. I I don't know if I'm, if I'm doing it wrong or what, but I can't. Let me turn this off. Can I turn it off? Yeah, okay. So I can't bend this and use it while I'm doing that. It, it hurts. I, I probably should move the whole thing. Let's try it just for... I don't know if this is how it's supposed to be used. I think I saw this in the picture, but we'll try it anyway. So um, we we'll go on. Oh, yeah. That's not, that's not near as bad. Okay. So now I can function. I can... Uh, at least I think I can. Of course, it stops and starts at unexpected times, so I have to get used to that, because that affects my what I'm my coordination and what I'm doing here. 
That is so weird, because, like, right now I'm trying to use my muscles to do something. And, okay, I'm going to have to turn that off. There. So I'm trying to use my muscles to do something, and then it's messing with them at the same time. And that, that doesn't seem to be very, very good. Um... Knife wants to cut into the actual product here. I don't want to do that. I just want to can I just get it open without cutting anything. That'd be great. The pain. Oh, it's on a pad. Okay, and I'm cutting through the pad evidently. So let's try again. Let's go over here. Cut in the notch on the corner. And then get behind the pad, and I think we'll do better. Cut the end open. Oh, yeah. I'll get this out. See if we can pull it by the pad. There we go. Yeah, I was cutting through that pad. And... Okay, I like this. Looking good. I don't think I damaged it. I think it's. I think we're good. Um. Yeah, I didn't damage it, so we're we're awesome. I was really careful. Okay. So um, now that we've got it on our pad here, we're ready to get it off. Let's put a. Let's take this one off of here because it's it's charged up pretty good. So let's take it off this one and stick it on here. Perfect. Okay, I do like that they're USB rechargeable. This is a pretty cool system, I think. Okay, now I think you're supposed to put this above your belly button. Let me look at the picture. Yeah, I guess, I don't know. We'll just stick it on and see what it does. I need a drink of water first. Okay, set this down. Now, let's peel this off. And see, since this has six different spots on it, we need to, there we go, do it from the center out. Okay, which side is supposed to be up? Does it actually matter? Okay, so belly button, I don't know. Let's just try, I think my abs start like right here. So let's just stick this here. And if I do this for a month, every day, it's supposed to do something. Now, let's see, it's supposed to get rid of my fat. So on and on uh that's i can feel it but i don't like it let's go to number two okay can we turn up the intensity a little bit okay that's probably a healthy amount right there if i go any higher it's probably gonna be unhealthy but oh yeah well i'll try it one higher i can turn it back down Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. That's that's probably going to be a workout right there. Just do that for an hour. Turn it back down a little bit, maybe. I'm turn that back up for a second. It, it seems like it's off-center or something because... Oh, there we go. So when I turn it up, my whole... Uh, my abs flex which is good, um, but when I uh, turn it down, it's like well, this side does more than that side or something, I don't know, could be how it's having contact or something, but yeah, see that's spread out, so I can turn the power level up to like two, whereas if I do on my arm, I can only do, it's got two pads, I can only do about one, but that's a good deal, I like it, I wonder if I should wear it like this while I'm doing the rest of my review videos here. It doesn't bother me that much. I mean, it's it's definitely doing something. It's definitely working, but it doesn't bug me too much. So I, I think I might be able to do the rest of my review videos with this thing on. But I'll try to do a follow-up review video like 30 days later and show you guys if 
my gut has went away or how this thing has worked. Hello everyone, we interrupt your broadcast to bring you Subscriber Bunny, reminding you to subscribe to YouTube and give to our Patreon and all of that wonderful, great stuff. Now back to your regularly scheduled video. But I should be wearing all these at the same time, but I can't really use my arms when I'm wearing this. I tried and... Um, oh, here is the thing, the pad for it's like invisible, so... There we go. Should plug the rest of these in, charge them up. What's my next review? Uh... Oh, okay. What time is it? Alright, so this sounds good. Um, I might do the other one later because I've got some other reviews I want to do right now, but I don't know. This thing, it's interesting. Feels good. Feels like it's doing its job, so. I think, I think, I believe in the concept. I believe that this thing works, and I believe that if you want uh, a machine like this, it's going to help you exercise or whatever you're going to use it for. So there's a lot of uses for these machines. Um, this definitely seems like a good product. Um, hopefully, I mean, the only thing I'd be careful of with this is bumping the buttons on here and increasing the intensity by accident, you know. That could be uh, painful, especially if you're trying to figure out how to turn it off, you know. This is on over here on the left. This is off on the right. So, um, and you see the button through my shirt. That's, that's pretty wild, I gotta say. I don't know how I'm going to feel when this is all over, but it definitely, it's definitely doing a, doing a good job. Um, and I think, I think you guys should try these. I think they're good. Um, I mean, especially, I think if you're already fit, it's probably going to, you know, help more as far as distinguishing your muscles and making everything look good. But, um, oh, yeah, I love the way it feels. I mean, I got to say that I love the, the workout feeling of this because it's like, it's like I'm kind of doing sit-ups, but I'm just sitting here, you know, and it doesn't really hurt. I'm not sweating. I'm not freaking out or anything. I'm not working really hard. It's it's just doing it, and I'm just sitting here. I could be working on my computer, editing videos, whatever, and my gut is getting toned. So that's a good deal, I think. I mean, my arms are already pretty decent. I, I mean, I'm thinking, you know, improvement is always good. So um, this isn't going to make me have to get surgery you know there's people I know and they work out really hard and all of a sudden they get have their shoulder worked on their knee worked on whatever this doesn't do that as far as I know I mean unless you're crazy and turn it up really high or something <laughs> I don't know but uh, yeah it's a pretty cool um, just make sure that you don't push the buttons on the front by mistake um, so I'll probably put it back in the box for now and try this out more in detail later once I'm not doing uh, you know, making recording videos, but uh, I sit and watch TV with these on. But again, with my arm, I just have to be careful not to bend it while I'm doing this because it seems to to hurt. But um, I, I look forward to using this product, and I want to see what it's going to do for me. I probably should leave the body pad out to put the thing back on. But yeah, good deal. All right, so make sure you subscribe so you can see how this turns out in the future. Um, check out uh, Patreon, all the links we got, all that great stuff. All right. Hello, everyone. We interrupt your broadcast to bring you Subscriber Bunny, reminding you to subscribe to YouTube and give to our Patreon and all of that wonderful, great stuff. Now back to your regularly scheduled video.